This CEO had his own company's robot kick him in the gut to show off its strength. Another humanoid company is facing a lawsuit claiming its robot is strong enough to quote, fracture a human skull. So how strong are humanoid robots really? The T-800 is made by Chinese robotic firm Engine AI. The cinematic lighting in the demo led many people to accuse the video of being somehow faked. This led the company to release several behind the scenes clips that show the same or similar actions from different angles in an effort to prove it was real. This culminated in the CEO of the company himself dressing up in padding to take a kick from the robot. I have to say the lack of head protection has me concerned, especially given how high this robot is able to kick. The first kick barely missed his face and he did step back. The next clip is where he actually absorbs the force of the kick and gets knocked to the ground. But how hard was that kick really? Anyone who's done any kind of self-defense or combat training may already be running to the comments to say that the CEO's stance here is not optimal. Ideal fighting stance would mean having your legs diagonally so you can absorb force from any direction and stay on your feet. Having both feet side by side means you have nothing in place to catch you when you start to fall back, which is exactly what happened here. The robot's form, however, looks pretty good to me. I wouldn't be surprised if it was operated or programmed by someone with fight experience. Folks with fighting training, please let us know what you think down in the comments.